What's going on guys and welcome back to another Forzathon Weekly Challenge. Now if you're new to this series, I'll be showing you a basic run through of challenges that make you Forzathon points. You can also double your rewards if you own this house location on the map, which is located near the Teotihuacan Ruins. Now before we get into those challenges, let's look at the seasonal items and the Forzathon shop for this week. For our first challenge, uh, own and drive the 2010 Nissan 370Z. You can easily find it inside the Yala Show or the Auction House, but either way, I should mention you use this vehicle through all four challenges. And you select your vehicles and you connect to the garage. Now it doesn't trigger right away, then you drive around the block for a few seconds. In the second challenge, you're going to spend 10,000 credits on upgrades. This is going to be anything inside the upgrades area from engine swaps or new tire compounds. As long as you're 10,000 credits or higher, but I would seriously set your vehicle up to do a little bit of everything from drifting to racing. Now third challenge, you're going to total 200,000 points from drift zones. And as usual, you have plenty of locations across the map to choose from, but up on the screen is two of the easiest in my opinion. As for the final challenge, you have to be any Rivals Ghost. That means you need to enter Rivals mode found inside the pause menu, and not only select any track that you like, but make sure you select whatever car class that you're using. Before you start the race, I would also like to give you a tip. I would try to find someone that has a dirty lap, which will have a little caution icon next to their time. After you find one and select it, you only need to complete the lap without crashing or using rewind. That also means you can drive as slow as you want. Well, that pretty much wraps up everything that you need to know in this week in Horizon 5. From here, I hope you found this pretty useful, and I'll see you next time.